Hello and welcome to the Elevate Podcast. I'm your host, Patricia Nowakowski. I am a salon owner, educator, mindset, and leadership coach that helps salon owners go from overwhelmed and burnt out to motivated and empowered. It is my mission to help you systemize your business, generate more profit, and create a career that you are absolutely in love with. Join us every week to learn about the small shifts you can make to elevate your business regarding mindset, marketing, social media, business systems, and so much more. Hello, and welcome to this week's episode of the Elevate Podcast. I'm actually really excited about today's episode because one of the things that I love to do in business is to set up systems and automations that actually work for your business to give you freedom as a salon owner and to take some of the burdens and heavy task load off your plate. I feel like so many salon owners struggle with hiring, and today we're going to talk about how to nurture future team members in a strategic way to help grow your salon team and to help build trust and to help with the hiring process for you as an owner. Wondering what it's like to work with me? Want to know what I've tried and tested in my salon and how you can create more freedom as a salon owner? I'm excited to offer an exciting way to get my coaching lessons to you in our podcast subscription. The Elevate Insider is an inside look into my coaching calls and includes exclusive content from me. These episodes contain coaching lessons and the exact steps you need to take to grow your salon. Plus, you'll receive special PDFs and supporting documents so that you can easily take action. To learn more and to become an insider, visit opulentbeautypro.com backslash insider or find an episode of the Elevate Insider on Apple Podcasts. So today we're talking about one of the most crucial aspects of salon business, which is hiring and nurturing future team members. I want to say that it can take up to six months of somebody watching you on social media and even getting to know you before they will even decide to work for you. And it's the same for clients. It can take up to six months for a client to actually become aware of your business and then to be nurtured to the point where they actually want to sit in your chair. I don't know why salon owners don't think of stylists in the same way that we think of clients clients, our stylists are essentially our clients, right? As an owner, that's how you grow and scale your business. It's by growing and scaling your team. And because this is a very constant thing that I am seeing in all of the salon owners groups that I'm in, today I'm going to give you a tip and a strategy to effortlessly nurture stylists that are possibly interested in your business. If we know how to attract and retain clients, why aren't we utilizing the same approach with hiring and doing it in the same way? What if I could help you nurture potential stylists the same way we build trust and educate our clients and create a relationship digitally that will help us in the back end and will help us stay in the back of their minds until the timing is just right for them to either choose a salon to work at or be there for them when they are finally ready to leave their current salon. If you have been struggling to find the right team members, then this episode is for you. I'm always gonna throw it out there. If you are not subscribed to the Elevate Insider, do that today. The Elevate Insider will give you for this episode already pre-written email templates that you can utilize in the funnel that we're going to be talking about in today's episode. So you literally can customize these email templates and you can begin to nurture future team members that can possibly put their information in your stylist funnel, which we're going to talk about today. 
So I'm going to break down exactly how you can nurture future stylists, build trust, and create an automatic hiring funnel that will have stylists reaching out to you when they're ready for a change. Stylists today have more options than ever, so it's not just enough to post a job listing and hope for the best on social media. It does not work that way. Indeed, all of those hiring websites have never worked for me. You need to build relationships with potential team members long before they're looking for a new opportunity and long before they will actually choose you as a salon owner. And that starts by nurturing them the same way you would nurture a client. Here's the reality. Stylists are watching your salon online. They're looking at your social media, asking about your reputation and hearing about you through word of mouth. They're keeping tabs on your brand and your culture long before they even consider applying. So it's your job to make sure they know who you are, what you stand for, and why you'd be a great place for them to grow. That is exactly how I picked my commission salon when I graduated school. It was word of mouth and it was reputation. I heard from everyone that that was the salon to work for. This was from family members, from other girls in beauty school in the area. They had a very solid name. And I think more so now than ever, it's not necessarily the salon that you have. It's the type of leader you are that's going to attract team members. So let's talk about building a stylist funnel and how to get the stylus in your funnel in the first place. The first thing that we need to do is we need to start by having an opt-in form on our website. This can simply be a join our team section with an enticing offer to have them put in their information on your website. Something like subscribe for career tips and opportunities. From there, stylus can easily sign up and they can be entered into your email sequence. It's important to make this process as seamless and inviting as possible. Let potential stylists know that they're opting in and they'll be part of an exclusive community or an exclusive education opportunity where they can get valuable insight on what it looks like to be at your salon and what it takes to actually grow their career. So I want to talk about the power of an email sequence Here's where we take things to the next level. Just like you nurture potential clients with an email marketing sequence, you could do the same for stylists. Let's say you have a join our team opt-in on your website. When stylists show interest, they subscribe and enter into an automatic email sequence. Again, when you subscribe to the Elevate Insider, we're going to give you a few templates to get this process started to take the overwhelm of what to actually put out there away from you so you can just plug and play. So I highly recommend that you join. It's literally only $7.99 a month and every single episode has more content and has supporting PDFs that are gonna help you create a blueprint for your business and that are gonna help you create structure and help you put systems in place to make your job easier as a salon owner. So if you are not subscribed yet, I highly, highly recommend. So this is a golden opportunity to keep nurturing these stylists who are interested in your salon through a series of valuable engaging emails. This automated nurturing sequence is going to do all the work for you behind the scenes. It's going to help you build relationships. It's going to help you build trust. And while you're focused on other areas of your business, this email sequence is automatically going to start building these relationships that we need to begin to build in order to get people to work in our business. The best part about this is when those stylists are ready to make a move, you'll already be on the top of their mind. You always want to position yourself as a mentor and someone who can help them grow more than their current salon owner. When we help people grow more than their current salon owner, they're going to see value in working for us. Again, it's the same thing as providing value for our clients. We have to provide value for our team and future team members in order to get them to want to stay in our business. When you do all of this, you'll be creating a steady flow of potential team members who know, like, and trust you long before they even sit down for an interview. And when the timing is right, they'll come to you. 
I think that this is such a brilliant idea. Again, we need to nurture those people that are potentially thinking about us. Do you know how many people I've had fill out our online application? And I wish I would have done this sooner because one, I think people get nervous to leave their current salon. It's a very scary thought to have a disruption in your finances. It's a very scary thought to potentially lose clients, which is another email that you can put in there as the sequence. And it can be nerve wracking to think about change. We have to remember that when somebody is thinking about switching salons, the current pain point they are experiencing in their current salon, because you know that stylists are looking for a new place because there's something that is not going well for them in their current situation, that could be lack of growth, that could be a toxic situation, there can be so many different things. Until that pain point is much greater then the pain point or the idea of leaving, they are going to stay, right? So we have to nurture them and we have to entice them to get them to come on over to our side. I hope today's episode was beneficial for you. Again, if you are interested in done-for-you systems and support, be sure to subscribe to the Elevate Insider And we will get those email templates over to you and you can start to create your email sequence to start nurturing potential stylists in your salon today. Thank you for listening. Be sure to subscribe and to leave a review and to share this episode with your salon owner bestie. Thanks for tuning in to the Elevate podcast. If you loved this episode, it would mean the world to me if you would leave a review on Apple Podcast or wherever you listen. The Elevate podcast is hosted by me, Patricia Nowakowski, and is produced by Opulent Beauty Pro. To receive my free business guides, visit opulentbeautypro.com backslash free or click the link in the show notes. You can find me on Instagram at Opulent Beauty Pro or at Patricia underscore Nowakowski underscore OBS. If you love this show, please consider subscribing and we will see you next week.